Kathy and I just spent several hours hiking up Highlight Canyon, which is just a bit south of Bozeman, Montana, part of the country we've never explored before. And this is just a beautiful stretch of land to hike through and enjoy. And along the way, we saw many cute little waterfalls to stop and just soak in and listen to and enjoy and wildflowers all along the way and other inspiring scenes to take in as well. And then here at the top, we come to this cute little lake, Highlight Lake, which is just a delight to sit around and eat your lunch and soak in the peaceful, calm, serene atmosphere that you find up here. Along the way though, I was just feeling a lot of gratitude for knowing that this path existed to get up here to this lake because a friend had recommended this hike to us. And so when we got into town, we pulled out our map and found the path and went to the trailhead early this morning, got on that path and up we came. You know, the path got us to where we expected to be and here we are in enjoying the results. Well, as we were walking that path though this morning, and I had a lot of hours to think and pray as we went along the way, I started thinking about all the other kinds of paths we choose in life and how sometimes we choose a path that gets us to a really good place and other times we choose a path that gets us to not such a good place. And then there's those times when it seems like there's no path at all in front of us. Have you ever been there? A time when you felt like no matter where you looked, you know, what you considered, there was no path forward, no open doors to walk through. And, as I was thinking that through, I thought, you know, that's really not possible. Because no matter where you are or what you're doing, there's always a path to take. And it's called the path to God. <laughs> and I, I was thinking that through, how the human mind often entertains limited options. It just sees limited ways of doing things and it sees shut doors, it sees walls, it sees obstacles, it, sees, it just sees reasons to not be successful. And that's because the human mind looks at everything from a material point of view, which is a very limited point of view. So it might very well come to the conclusion that there's no path to walk down here. Well, if you ever feel that way, check that feeling because it's really not true. There's always a path to take and it's called the path to God. And it's the path of spiritual mindedness. I remember a time in my life when I felt like I couldn't figure out where to go and what to do next, you know, with my life. And I, I felt stuck. And I finally came to the conclusion that I wasn't going to figure it out humanly. I needed to let God figure it out spiritually and reveal it to me. So instead of focusing on how to find this path uh, through human ways and means, I focused on understanding God better. That God was an all-knowing, all-wise mind that had a solution to any problem I ever faced in my life. And my job was to get into a state of thought of receptivity, of hearing and listening for those solutions coming from God that would tell me where the path is and how to take it and how to get to where I needed to be. And it took two or three years of just humble, quiet listening and growing in my understanding of God's ability to always be there directing and guiding me. And sure enough, as I found my peace of mind and was just in a state of trusting where God was taking me, a plan became apparent. And I knew what I needed to do, I knew how I needed to do it, and I proceeded to do it and with good results, which I have enjoyed for decades ever since then. So anyway, there always is a path to take. If you ever feel stuck, like you don't know what to do or where to go next, don't buy into it. Just go a little higher with your thought. There is a path out. It's called the pathway to God. The pathway to the all-knowing, all-wise mind that knows where to go, how to go, and what to do along the way. Be patient, listen, and the path will become apparent to you. There's always a path that you can take.